Hello everyone, it's PC Helper here and in this video I'll be showing you how you can fix DirectX error for the game Call of Duty Warzone. A lot of users have been complaining about this problem, so I've got a really quick fix for this problem. So let's get started. So before starting any solution, what you can do is, first you have to clean boot your PC. This is a necessary step before starting any solution or so. So once you have clean booted your PC, then you can start with all the solution and in many cases, just clean booting your PC is fixing this problem. So if you don't know how to clean boot your PC, you can just watch my video on how to do so. I will provide you the link of this video in the description of this video. It is a 2 minute 45 seconds guide. So I won't be covering it in this video because it will make this video long. So once you have done so, the second thing you have to do is, once you have clean booted your PC, you have to make sure that you have DirectX up to date. So just click, just search for download DirectX. And go to this first link by Microsoft and here select your language and click on download and soon your down DirectX downloading will be start and once you have downloaded it you just have to run the setup and once you have run the setup you have to install DirectX and once you have done it now comes the most important step and the most probable work on that's working for most of the users so I have not installed the game Call of Duty Modern Warfare in the PC I'm using for recording so I will show you how to do how to fix this problem with the help of screenshots. So this is the first screenshot. So you have to go to a battle.net that is the Blizzard application and here go to Call of Duty Modern Warfare and click on options and first of all you have to try scanning and repairing your game. Once you've done it your problem might be solved after doing it but if it isn't just go to your game settings here and once you are in your game settings go to Call of Duty Modern Warfare. As I also had Call of Duty Black Ops 4, but you have to go to Call of Duty Modern Warfare and select this additional command line arguments. And once you have selected it, write in it D3D11. First write a dash, then D3D11. This means it will automatically activate DirectX 11 to open this game, to run this game. So once you have done it, then most probably your problem will be fixed. So I hope this works for you. If it doesn't, please write in the comment section and explain your problem to me in detail. I will surely try to help you. So thank you, thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please hit the like button below. And also, don't forget to subscribe for more. Thank you and have a nice day.